The days are winding down. Just 23 more days until Tech Tech football takes the field at Jones AT&T Stadium. While the Red Raiders have the day off today, we figured we should continue with our positional breakdowns as we shift from offense to defense and zero in on the guys who are face to face with the opposing team's offense, the defensive linemen. Our Lauren Cottrell has more. It's no secret that the Big 12 is considered to be a strong offensive conference, making the work of a defense that much more important, especially for the guys who come directly face to face with those offenses, the defensive linemen. Texas Tech's 2022 defensive line is favorable to be a deep group under the direction of new position coach Zarnell Fitch. And leading that pack again this year are seniors Tony Bradford and Jalen Hutchings, who had his best season to date in 2021 leading the D-line in total tackles. And as a duo, the two combined 37 solo tackles on the season. The Big 12 had us ranked ninth this year uh, coming out, and that's just, that's not where we want to be at all. It's just a ranking, so we take that to heart and um, build upon it. You know what I'm saying? People don't think much about us, and we're going to prove them wrong. There were also some new faces added to the defensive line this season, the first of those being Red Raider track and field star Gabe Oladipo, who decided to give football a try after exhausting his track and field eligibility in June. In addition, freshman four-star Joseph Adetere has been on defensive coordinator Tim DeRuiter's watch list for a while now, saying Adetere exhibits the mental and physical toughness that a defensive lineman needs. And while some may question the youth of this group as a whole, the size and strength of these new guys are sure to add some grit to this already tough room. We've got a fairly solid about one and a half deep uh, and we've got some new guys that have joined us this summer uh, both freshmen and transfers and they're gonna have opportunities to get in that two deep but I, I like you know like I said that first one and a half I think I think we've got some guys that can play we've got a good start on it.